this teaching is what spirituality is going to be in the future not just me, already there are teachers starting talking like this all over the world because there is no other way than there to the center of the being, to the truth of the system Namaskar I have a question about how to disconnect to a former lover to which I now still feel a very strong negative connection energetically. It comes up sometimes out of the blue that I suddenly feel miserable and get fever and all that kind of symptoms. And then I kind of make the conclusion he's meeting with other people. So there's kind of energetic movement with him going on. I really would like to disconnect from that negative relationship. Yes, maybe fed by still having emotions about that. The other thing is that he once said that when you have an active Kundalini Shakti, that one would have to take very much care about whom to partner up with. And I've been in a state of spontaneous celibacy for seven years or so. And then when the Shakti moved, I got really interested in sex. Kind of also a very strong pull. Now I figured out that I should not follow the pull actually, because it's not the pull of the soul. But I still kind of suffer from that connection. And I really like the guy, the person. I really like him. But I would like to cut that. There are questions that I would have about this because it's not clear exactly what kind of connection it is. And uh, because it could be a a same soul connection, in which case it's quite a big challenge, tough challenge, and it can be lifelong. And if you want to get out of this mess, apart from the whole Kundalini issue or story, the only way, immediately, right now, no no discussion about it, in the sense that that's how it is, is to tune into the Soul, every time, even the thought appears of that person. You go inward, and you go into the surrender state, immediately. Why I'm saying that is, is that your suffering, it doesn't mean that it's a toxic connection, or it's a negative this or that, just because it's causing you suffering, doesn't mean it's negative, you know? It could also mean that that is the key for you to go into the Self-Realization fully, to move into the Self-Realization process, into surrender and into oneness with that core and center of your Being. Because when you're in that state, the more you are in a state of surrender to Source, the less negative that connection will be. You are suffering because He is with somebody else. That's all not important in this story. He will... you, 100,000 percent, like... It may take a year, it may take two years. Even if you don't want him, he'll come. Because that's the point, no? When a person is with themselves, in, in that Truth, then there's no suffering, then everyone is attracted to them. Who wants to be with somebody who's in pain? Would you like to be with someone who's continuously in pain? No, you'll run away. Unless, of course, you have that side to you which is empathetic and wants to help somebody, but that's then a different paradigm. No. There is no way around this. Life is telling you, Sol, you got to get to the cheese, 
लेकिन हिंदी चीज मीन्स द सिंग दिस इज द सोल द सोर्स इट्स ऑल्सो लाइक अ माउस हैज टू गेट टू द चीज एंड ईट इट एंड देन इट्स ट्रैप्ड इन इटर्नल लव यू नो you have to go inward because life is pushing you in there and it's pushing you in there because it has found no other way to make you do that because the ego if you do that right away today by the time the next system comes you'll already be in a different state remember go inward the pain strikes push it out go inward and i know that that can be horrendous that pain it's not something a person can describe in words and it goes over years how long has this been going on for you for 3 years i was trying to convince the guy to have a sexual relationship with me because he is kind of not really in the body but i felt the very strong pull to be with him sexually but it didn't work out energetically as well no it can't work out it can't it won't work out those things never work out because then if it works out then you're again out of yourself you're not in surrender life is pushing you into self realization bend down it's saying you can't go anywhere there is no where else to go but in word no where else for you left and when you make that step you'll see what will happen but it's challenging the other alternative you have is that you're 90 years old and the same story is going on with the same guy that's the other alternative you can choose what you prefer i would suggest take the route inward do the kriyas whatever you hear and see this teaching is what spirituality is going to be in the future not just me already there are teachers starting talking like this all over the world because there is no other way than there to the center of the being to the truth of the system and when you are in that truth state you are not in a pain state when you are not in a pain state then everyone that rejects you turns around and moves towards you i'm not saying he's going to jump into bed with you but that's also not what you actually want what you want is the experience of that oneness and because it's not happening in any of the other realms that's the one that seems to you to be something you can try out he's going to run away from you as long as you are not with your self life is telling you that life is pushing you into self realization and the more you self realize the more the person will turn towards you don't let it go on for years and years it won't stop huh? don't think oh no it'll be fine after 2 years no it won't be fine after 2 years this doesn't sound like one of those it will be fine the less i think about him no no you can't stop thinking about him you cannot you cannot stop it it will continue unless you are in a surrendered state the truth the truth the truth the truth the truth the truth 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 every time that thought of him comes you go into the truth every time the tears flow you go into the truth no other way out otherwise you are 90 years old and it's still going on i don't think you want that yes